I am Kyle Bailey. I'm the content ninja. It is 1.17 in the morning, and I'm about to show you a really cool tool that I use uh, to create my overhead uh, PowerPoints, whatever you want to call it. I was never in a culture that, or an office culture that kind of ingrained PowerPoint into me, so I was never, uh, I never had to it's never become like a part of me. So I don't know it inside and out. Some of you out here that know PowerPoint inside and out are not gonna like this. That's not the point. The point is this is easy, it's fast, and the presentations look great. I have given probably 30 presentations using Haiku Deck, and I have yet to walk out of one without somebody making a comment, uh, a really strong positive comment about the way my deck looked uh, in that presentation. And, uh, it's usually much stronger than that. There's usually several people coming up and saying how much they loved it. Um, I get comments from other presenters all the time about how they, they just think it's great and it's so easy and so fast. So I'm going to show you, um, how to do it. I just had an idea. This is one of the things I love about it. You have an idea, bam, 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 you're done. This is, I'll prove it to you. So we're going to create a new deck. Um, I pay I use the paid version. Uh, one of the things I really believe in for small business owners, I talked about this uh, just yesterday in a uh, forum that I was at, is go ahead, always invest in the paid version. There's very few paid versions now that are going to try to lock you in. Go ahead and pay the paid version because you get the whole experience instead of just the free options. And you end up with a very limited version of whatever the uh, tool is. So get the paid version, get the whole thing. So we are going to start. So um, we're going to title this five Okay, Five Reasons WordPress is the only website for SMB. I might change that title a little bit later, but it gets the point across. Um, little content generation tip, never get hung up on anything. As soon as you feel the urge to get hung up, like I just did right there, I'm like, that's not quite the right wording. But I'm, I'm going to go ahead and slap it on there and get started because motion solves most things. For instance, what generally happens with me with copy is if I get hung up on a title, I have enough experience now to know that I'm going to go into this content and halfway through this content, my subconscious is going to kick out another title that I like better. If that doesn't happen, I'm going to sit and, and uh, mull on this overnight. And uh, tomorrow morning by lunch, I'll have five or six more titles. So don't get hung up. Start producing because what, what happens is you get all these ideas out of you and they're allowed to breathe and they actually produce more content. It's a beautiful thing about the way your mind works. All right, so WordPress. What I'm trying to get across here is some, some really key aspects of WordPress. And the reason I had the idea to do this presentation is because I was thinking about how a couple of key aspects of WordPress, I'm like, well, that's a haiku deck. Now, one of the things I really like about haiku deck is you can make all of your um, presentations public. So that's another indexable quality. I haven't really plumbed the depths yet on how to use that for SEO to get more links into a site. They're not going to matter a whole lot. Um, but the fact that you have discoverable content out there is great. Uh, I, don't, I have not fully optimized anything, but what the, really all I'm talking about today for Haiku Deck is the pure functionality of it, not some back-end benefits like SEO and things like that, indexable qualities. I'm really talking about the front-end benefit, which is the presentation uh, qualities, the, the functional presentation uh, uh, pros for it. All right, so, all right, so Five Reasons WordPress is the only website builder for small business owners. One, responsive. This really has taken over everything else because of the Google changes. So um, WordPress is mobile friendly. Let's say mobile is baked in. All right, so 
responsive probably isn't going to get me anything baked in probably will get me some nice images now this is the magic of haiku deck so um what's beautiful about haiku deck is all these images are royalty free so you can use all of these in all the presentations you want to and you don't have to pay um a royalty fee for it or for anything so another really nice feature is i can kind of look at this you've got this new this is a relatively new zoom feature they haven't always had this <clears throat> so i can um kind of make this larger or smaller see what might work i don't think i like this one let's uh look down here i'm not going to go too long because that's not the point part of it is but it's not the main point of today let's see what this little double loaf looks like i think i'll like that yeah we're gonna go with that for now okay so one mobile friendly is baked in we add another uh, slide now this they have bullet point number slide this one's a really great one to have for the beginning or the ending with your profile picture and then contact information in here i actually haven't used this one yet i'll check that out later but this one i like because you can just add text and it kind of stacks it nicely this is a, like a general text um uh slide okay google Always good to spell things correctly. All right, so now we click this image again. Let's try Google. Let's see if they're going to give us anything. Oh, nice. Sometimes it's hard to get trademark names. Um, I like this one. Let's see how that goes. I think that's going to play well. Um, so some trademark names don't. You can't. It's very difficult to get them. Also, a lot of these images trend. Um, Eastern, so they're not going to trend like USA. I think the reason for that is because people in India and China and places are dumping images onto the web uh, with no thought about roy royalties, where people in the US are more guarded about their images. I think that's probably the case. Um, let's go ahead and go with trademark, even though this is not the newest trademark of Google. It works for me. Um, I would test this on an overhead. Uh, to double check it, but it works for now. People can see that enough. Um, all right, so now we're going to go to this is a uh, sleep. Now, I don't know if I, I didn't point this out before. I don't know if it's uh, accurate. I mean, um, if it is uh, perfectly clear to you, but I will go through this. Basically what it's doing is it's breaking apart what I said here, what I typed. And it's you can click on each one of these. Um, it's a little hard to get back to them sometimes, um, but uh, it, 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 it um, pulls based on what you typed and you can always search it again up here so if i want working instead of sleep <clears throat> so this is a nice one like you're working under the hood but i like sleep but i think sleep is better but i just wanted to illustrate how easy it is to use the search function here um, as kind of an extender of what they're doing for you um, I think I've illustrated how uh, great this is. Um, I'm going to go ahead and save this. Um, another thing that they have here is they have charts and graphs and things like this. So you can add these charts in here as well. I don't use charts as much, but I will be in the future. These are that, That's a relatively new function that Hootsuite, I mean, uh, um, Haiku Deck is added. And you can uh, change theme colors and all that stuff but honestly the most the thing i use the most is just straight up um images uh 
I just really like the uh, the image function of it and how well it works. I uh, hope this helps. Uh, hi, if you do any speaking at all, um, I highly recommend this. Uh, it's a it's a as I think I've already illustrated, and it's a little bit late, so I'm probably a little bit bleary eyed. Uh, it's a great tool. Uh, I'm Kyle Bailey. I'm the Content Ninja, and I have one question for you. What are you doing to make your business grow today? Hope this helps.